Hello students, hope that you're safe and fine. Welcome back to our SSE class. Today, we will be using the same book, that is the part 1 book. So be ready with your book, copy book and your pencil case. Yesterday, we learned about wood and objects made of wood. Let us do a recap about that. As you can see on the screen, we can see a few things that are made of wood. These things are made of wood. Let us spell wood together. W O O D wood W O O D wood W O O D wood Let us take a look at the first picture. It is a table. The table is made of wood. The table is made of wood. The second picture is a desk. The desk is made of wood. The desk is made of wood. The third picture is a ladder. It is made of wood. As we can see, the ladder is made of wood. The next picture is a shed. The shed is made of wood. What is the shed made of? It is made of wood. The pencils are made of wood. What are they made of? They are made of wood. Do you know that your pencils are made of wood? All the pencils are made of wood. Observe your pencil. What is it made of? Wood, isn't it? Now we can see a bookshelf. The bookshelf is made of wood. The bookshelf is made of wood. This picture is a bird table. What is it made of? The bird table is made of wood. What is it made of? It is made of wood. This is a chest of drawers. What is it made of? It is made of wood. The chest of drawers is made of wood. And lastly, we can see a wardrobe. What is it made of? It is made of wood. The wardrobe is made of wood. The wardrobe is made of wood. Now, open your book on page 117. Today, we are going to learn about objects made of paper. Observe the first picture. What can you see? Yes, tissue paper. So tissue paper is made of paper. Next picture, we have flowers made of paper. Next, we have envelopes. They are made of paper. We can see 
writing paper. It is also made of paper. Then we have paper bags. Paper bags are made of paper. And lastly, we have the calendar. A calendar is made of paper. So all these objects that you can see on page 117 of the book, they are made of paper. Let us see some more objects made of paper. We can see some more objects made of paper. We have notebook paper, facial tissue, toilet paper, new computer paper, computer paper, paper towels, napkins, new notebook paper. So all these objects are made of paper. We use paper in order to produce these objects. Here are some more examples of objects made of paper. So we have the first picture, magazines. Second picture, we have paperboard. Next, we can find telephone directory. And lastly, we have the newspaper. All these objects are made of paper. Now, I want all of you to observe this picture. What can you see? We all can see a jar and four glasses, isn't it? What are they made of? They are made of glass. Let us spell glass together. G L A S S glass. G L A S S glass. Now open your book on page 118 and we are going to see to look at some objects made of glass. The first picture we can see a drinking glass. Second picture we can see some bottles. Next picture we can see a table made of glass. Next we can see a window pane. An aquarium is made of glass. Also we have spectacles made of glass. As you can see, we have these six objects and they are made of glass. Words to learn. As you know, you have to know these three words by heart. Wood, paper and glass. So if you are not revising, please start revising and learn these words by heart. Wood, paper and glass. Now what I have learned, corner. Let us read the, four, the first bullet point. There is a variety of things around us. Second bullet point. Things can be alive or not alive. Next one. Things can be classified into living and non-living things. Donc, on a beaucoup de choses autour de nous. Ces choses-là peut être en vie ou not alive ou ils n'ont pas de vie. Things can be classified into living and non-living things. Toutes les choses qui sont autour de nous, we can classify them, we can regroup them, we can name them as being a living or non-living thing. On peut dire si c'est un living ou non-living thing. People, animals and plants are living things. Comme vous le savez déjà, des humains, des plantes et des animaux, tout ça, they are living things. All living things breathe, 
need food, grow and change. This you know it already. All living things breathe, need food, grow and change. Next one, we must take care of animals and plants. And lastly, many non-living things or objects around us are made of wood, glass and paper. So your homework will be to copy this what I have learned corner in your copybook. I repeat, as homework you will have to copy what I have learned the corner, uh, the notes that have been put in a rectangle you have to copy this in your copy book so we have come to the end of our class i thank you for your kind attention keep revising your notes and do the homework stay home stay safe see you tomorrow